نحمده ونصلي على رسوله الكريم أما بعد فأعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب اشرح لي صدري وأسل لي أمري وحل عقدة من لساني يفقه قولي السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته brothers and sisters ولا تحسني يوم يبعثون يوم لا ينفع مال ولا بنون إلا من آت الله بقلب سليم Inshallah, we will be discussing building tombstones and building of the graves. So, building over the graves, in the hadith of uh, Jabir radiallahu anh, he said, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, uh, it is forbidden to plaster the graves, to sit on them and to build, erect uh, monuments upon them. So this is very common as we see in the Turkish culture and uh, other cultures. We will find that they build over uh, monuments over their graves. So if you take a sultan or a righteous person, a shafai, uh, he said, I saw that the imams in, in Mecca, they ordered to, for, the, for the buildings of the grave that were erected over the graves to be knocked down. And uh, Abu al-Hayaj al-Asadi, he said, Ali ibn Talib, he said to me, Shall I send you on the same mission as Rasulullah sallallahu sent me to not leave any statue without erasing it and to not and to not leave any raised grave except that you level it. So raising a grave, raising the grave or erecting a monument over the grave because of their status or their righteousness is is a is haram as as in the hadith of Rasulullah sallallahu however if you have a mark on the grave you have like a tombstone on the head of the grave then that is permissible if you want to differentiate between the graves um when Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi when Uthman ibn Mazun radiallahu anhu he he passed away then Rasulullah sallallahu ordered a man to bring a, a stone to mark for his head. The man could not carry it. Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa rolled up his sleeves. He took the stone and he put it at the head of the grave. As for this, it is permissible. It is from the sunnah and it is not bid'ah. So Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi he put the stone at the head. And that is, that is uh, from the sunnah. However, erecting any monuments over a grave is... So, I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to protect us from the fitna of this dunya and from the fitna of what is coming. Falling into the traps of shaitan, practicing what is wrong and is not prescribed in Islam. So with that, brothers and sisters, subhanahu rabbi ka rabbil izzati amma yasifun, wa salamu ala al-mursaleen, wa alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Salamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu, brothers and sisters. ولا تحسني يوم يبعثون يوم لا ينفع مال ولا بنون إلا من آت الله بقلب سليم